the hunt beginning. I am ready. Just so. This bodeth ill. I will. Let in the hunt begin it. Let in my arrow fly in true. Coming if 
thou darest. The hunt ends. I am ready. 
The peacock struck. Here I go! Fatal Let my arrow fly in truth. I'll do my best. Let's do this. I will not be defeated. What next? Let my arrow fly in truth. Yeah! I am ready. My turn now! You got more than you bargained for. Against me, then be hunted. My turn now. Fatal. Come in if thou darest. I am ready. The peacock struck. I'll do my best. The peacock struck. 
Letting my arrow fly in true. What to do? Fatal! My turn now. Shine forth. I'll do my best. Huh? Ah! I am a sacred place to shine forth. I am not made for such battles. I see. I will. Well then. <sighs> Allow me to have a look. I am ready. The peacock struck. What to do? For you. Letting my arrow fly in true.
Letting my arrow fly in truth. Letting my arrow fly in true. I am ready. Beginning. Well then, prepare yourself. Ah! Flames, burn this away. <laughs> ah! Letting the hunt begin. It holding back nothing.
stay strong. I'll not be defeated. Okay, prepare yourself! Alfred, bring your own plane! <laughs> This will help. <laughs> what to do? For you! Come in, if thou darest. In this, I'll not prepare yourself. Flames, burn this away. I hope I've grown more of them. A formidable beast, but this was not the red eye that Master sought. Which meaneth, our true quarry lieth deeper within the forest. Master! But frozen, petrified in stone, what unholy thing happened here? Master's arrows. Did this fate befall him even as he drew his bow? There is a note tied to the shaft. To whomever readest this, like as not. Thou foundest this next to a stone figure. That's me, the hunter, Zanta, in the flesh, so to speak. I was commissioned by the Knights Ardant to hunt in the beast they call an Red Eye. A beast that hath left me in this unfortunate state. Among Red Eye's formidable powers is the ability to petrify. Already my feet have turned to solid rock. I have but a short time to pen this message before the curse overtaketh me completely. In a village called Stillsnow, there is a seer by the name of Susanna. Surely she shall knoweth what to done about this petrification. It is a faint hope, but the only one that remaineth to me. This beast cannot be allowed to run on amok. It is far too dangerous, too savage. Pray home with me, not for my sake, but for the innocents who dieth if this creature is not put him down. And Honnet, if thou art reading this, pray forgive us this old man for not keeping that promise. The old fool, even as he was turning to stone. <laughs> so thou wilt stay in and watchest over him. That is good. I will seek out this seer Susanna, and pray she knoweth a way to break in the curse. <coughs> Fearest not, Master. We will save you. Of this I swear.
I should first return to Natalia and tell her what we have found. Good to see you. Greetings. Uh, what? Mm. Is true. Hmm. Huh? Hmm. Truly. <laughs> Indeed. But... It's like this. I see. Um... God's a mercy for a hunter of Zanta's skill to succumb. I would hear all thou knowest about this red eye. I fear I know very little, nothing even. The Knights Ardant simply bid me hire Zanta. They told me nothing more. But it is clear they must have known the danger. Then why send one man to face the monster alone? Not any man. <sighs> so great was the peril, they could turn to no one else. On the hunt, no one could match his speed, his guile. If they had sent a regiment with him, he would have squandered his strength just to keep them alive, or so they said. It is true. Our village wanteth not for skilled hunters, but even the best of them would only get in, in his way. The knight's judgment was correct. But even so... It leaves a bad taste in your mouth, yes. It is the same for me. By sending one man alone, we declared to the world our own weakness. Now it falls to me to hunt Red Eye in Zanta's stead. Hunt it. You have another duty. You must go and find the Seer. Yes. It was Master's last command before the curse overtook him. I will find the means to free him of it. I must. Zanta's lucky to have such capable friends. My skill in the hunt is hardly the measure of his. 
But he needs me, and I will do what I can. Countless times Zanta has lent me his strength and courage. Now it is time to give of mine. I shall send word if I learn more of this Red Eye. Thank thee. Fear him not. We will save him, Master. Natalia? I'm so glad I caught you. Here, this is for your journey. There was no need for thee to... It's a trifle, compared to what you and Eliza are doing. Zonta was a good friend to me, after my husband passed away and all. Now I can't go fight no monsters like you two. Yes, but... So the least I can do is help you on your journey. Let me do that much at least. Of course. Thank thee for the gift. And, uh, one more thing. Promise me you won't do anything foolish now, will ya? Even for Zanta's sake. I will be cautious. After all, I'll be of no use to Master if I get myself killed. Exactly. Good luck to you, Hanit. Thank thee. I promise that I will return, and Master with me. <laughs>